Hey. He, had some, he had some excellent pickup blocks. Yeah. Something's happened to him, whether he's getting a little better. Did you see him running today? He's a different guy. He's got some Running? Is that weight so room? Talkative, joking here. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> and that's what we need. Right. And we're feeling pretty good about ourselves. You know, a lot of stars, a lot of nice awards. None of this will help us next week. So come down out of the clouds by tomorrow. Let's start kicking our ass. You know what kicking ass means? said that you know this could be the last chance he'll ever have mm -hmm. to beat his dad. There's a game on here. Can I say the same for this? A game on here? I, I just checked it. There's a game. I don't know if it's North Penn Arse now. There's definitely a game on. I just think we'll, we'll probably be a little looser this time. Um, you know, we're, we're, uh, we'll, we'll definitely be the clear-cut underdog so we'll, we'll really uh, you know, I think the pressure will be on them. We, we have we have nothing to lose. The question was set for that before, right? We have nothing to lose. <laughs> <laughs> it's like every team that plays us, we have nothing to lose. Um, what, what were you saying to WMPV at halftime, my fan? You're inciting my fans there. Inciting your fans? Um, um, you heard what that guy said? I have to be like me. Thank you. What did I say? I don't know. I don't say it was very four benign. It's a four very people, benign four interview. Four brought me the North Bend reporter. Did he really say this? To me, the quote was, "Hey, if we're going to win one, let's win the second one." Was my quote to Laura Borden. Yeah, well, you know, people said, "Hey, we can't beat him twice, so we'll win one." Hey, we'll win the second one. Man, that's all I said. All right. Well, okay, I got a uh, trip to Hawaii from Pichotti starting Thursday night. Three days, four nights. All expenses paid. <laughs> Uh, could we send Mikey with him? Oh, oh sure. No. <laughs> you know, if you pin me down at this stage of the game over the last three years, I'd say, hey, I don't want to do this again. Mm -hmm. But like players, what usually happens is a couple weeks after the season, it's like, hey, you know, you miss it. You miss the preparation. Mm -hmm. You miss the excitement. You miss the challenge. You miss the action. Captain, please. All right, this is the road to Hershey. This is the District 1 final. You want to go to States? Straight set up, jet left, 37 pitch. and probably right, get to the final game. Go, come on! Yeah! Who yeah. wants it? Be lost! Let's go. Power right end over, 58 pitch pass. I was like, I can run quick counties. Like, I was saying, you can't catch a cold. He can't catch a cold. Yeah, what's up now? I hey, know it's trapped. I don't know. They're big. What do you got? What about you? there Thursday rooting for you, okay? Would you like to give Junior some more shots, or? Right, yeah, thanks. Am I going to give my, you know, I don't know. If I'm smart, I'll probably say, 
<laughs> but uh, I'm going to wait and see again, you know. But right now is not a good time to ask me because the last about, who knows, seven, eight years this time of the year, it's like, it's a long season. That's it. I mean, how do I feel? I feel relieved. Well, I'm just relieved that I, I know it's time. And I've always said that they, you should never hang around uh, for the wrong reasons. Coaching, records, uh, to me, and then the total scheme of the universe, uh, you know, football or the coaching records don't seem all that important. I don't consider myself old, but you know, I lost one of my best friends, uh, best man at my wedding, guy I played football with. That's a real eye opener, you know, in his 50s. There's a lot of things uh, you know I want to do, and football is just a year-round proposition. So it's time to uh, emphasize the other things in life, you know. I don't. You know, if he feels he's ready to pass the torch, then you know we're, I'm I'm here ready to take it. So. Mike, doing scouting for you, Junior. Yeah, he's been watching some film. This comes all without this stuff that my guys are too dumb to <laughs> run this stuff. Yeah. You know? He's got the answers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I gotta get over and see him sometime. How's he doing? <laughs> he's still stinging. I'll bet. <laughs> And then a parent came in and talked to me the other day and said, hey, remember those pledges, coach, you get guys to sign? Well, a couple of your pl players don't think much of them. If I get the names, it's going to be a shame. But you're going to have to learn a tough lesson that there are more important things than winning. I heard they're really good. Yeah, it's a Lehigh Valley All-Star team. I didn't know that. Think about it. I think we're frankly going to whoop the crap out of him. <laughs> <laughs> Sucks. It's a good day for an ass whooping, fellas. Now, sometimes you get to the point you just feel you can't be beaten. Confidence is good, but there's a fine line where you go over the edge. And then you are beaten because of the way your mindset is. You never know until you face real adversity about your true chemistry. We haven't faced a whole lot of adversity yet. This is what it's all about. You got a team that's taunting you. You know, you got a great atmosphere in the mountains and 20,000 people, and that's do or die. Every day, people ask me, why the hell do you drive a half an hour, 40 minutes up there every single day for practice? And you got to come back an hour at home. Why? because I want to be around ass kickers, you understand me? Ass kickers! Now this could be one of the greatest wins ever. What has been your goal? Most of you go, if I go back and get out your goal sheets, what's your goal there, Mitski? To get back to where? Back to Hershey. And this just might be Pachati territory. Here he is. Will take over on the 32-yard line. Hey, Pichotti, you got a hole in the damn ball. It all starts with the damn fumble. Here's Wilson trying to find. No, it's a pass into the end zone. Everybody fooled on the play. Touchdown, Hawks. And for the first time all year, CB West trails in a football game. Second and one. He's got the first down, and he rumbles quickly to the outside. A little extracurricular activity for Mario D'Angelo, this Hawk team 
is not at all C.B. West. Unbelievable. Hey, Borda going high. He loses the football. It is picked up. And look out, here comes the rumble and Angelo Polina. Can't do that. Look out, here come the Bucks in the end zone. Touchdown, CB West. Here's the punt, Sibir back to the nine yard line. Look at him lose people. Still on his feet. He took that ball. This man knew he was in for a fight this afternoon. Yeah, that picture pretty indicative of the way this first half is going. You know, Bethlehem Catholic is taking it to CB West right now. They lead Central Box West 14 to 7 as they head into the locker room. So, you know, if we're going to be a championship team. We got to get our act together here at halftime. Yeah. 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 All right, first of all, I look around the locker room, I see a dead locker room, I see a lack of confidence, I see guys acting like it's over. Now, I told you yesterday, you might be behind, you're behind. I told you before how other West teams have responded on this very field. I right, think in West tradition, no West teams ever quit in the big game, and you aren't going to quit today. Now, this game is ours for the taking, if you want it. to the crowd go wild behind their book. Only in five or six. They in five. Central Bucks West doesn't have to think about it. They're going to go for it. Fourth and a yard and a half for the hard defense to the bend. Pizzani, he close, he is stuck. From the football, and it's picked up, and he's sick They need a big third down here. Right now, CB West, if they're going to move on and play for a third state championship, I think right now it's going to have to happen from their defensive unit. They're going to need a big play from those guys. McGorick takes the pitch, wants to throw, lets it fly, but he's hit, it's up for grabs, and it's picked up, it's picked up by Ted Kenyon, and Kenyon, after the catch on the pick, makes his way to the 45-yard line. Fourth and about a yard and a half. A tremendous play coming up here. Be the play of the game right here. Here we go. Oriole under center. A yard and a half to go for first down. They need to get to the 32. It's a hit hard and stopped. And it could be the third turnover by Downs this afternoon. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. We're still only one down. Stop from here. Come here. I don't want my damn season to end. Well, you got to make plays. Watch. They're going to go play action again. They're going to try to, you know, 
Put the stake in. Three fourth down stands, a pair of fumble recoveries. And an interception. That spelled the difference here. Here comes Wilson to the outside. And he is Need a big play on defense. Fourth and nine and a half of the Hawks in the 30. Florida drops back under pressure. Loses the football and falls on it, but he loses it either way. No line says we can run it right down and throw. Under six minutes to play in regulation. Stands at his 30-yard line and booms another one. A lot of air with that football. He'll be handled at the 23-yard line. They're on the sidelines. Ten. New leader on the field. It's a touchdown for Central Bucks West. That might be the first punt return against Beck all year. All right, this is it, baby. Exciting. First down and ball. Touchdown, Bucks. Like number four. Number four in the country, bullshit. I'm just like, you wait, just wait. Like, what are you screaming shit in for? What were you screaming in? I just came around the clock, that's all. Wait, what down is this? Wait, I mean, I don't think you're any much out of Dustin. You know, he's hurting all over. Do you see his back? His back, he's got no skin. They don't care about me. They don't care if I get the shit kicked out. Mini violin. Coach, there are thousands of high schools in this great country of ours. And when you look at the top ten ranked high school football teams in the country, two of them will play Saturday for the Pennsylvania <laughs> State. Well, I mean, that's heady stuff. Well, that's, that's, that's neat. You know, uh, some people are trying to make this out to be a national championship. Yeah, Where are you going next year? Uh, I'm not sure yet. Don't know? Sure yet, no. Do you have an idea? Uh, I hear Florida's nice. You know, this is a prep school. A lot of preppies, they think they're smart, they're, they're aloof, they're looking down on us. Oh, yeah, let's go right to the block. Oh, shit. All right, punt block. <laughs> and you have more wasted effort than I've ever seen. You, know, you should be blocking half of these things. A gap. Once again. Do you ever look and say four yards in front? You can watch the film. I was four yards in front. That's my point. If Coach carries air and I'm four yards in front, I want to go across four yards. You're four yards here, and then you dive into the guy. If you were doing it right, you want to rough the kicker. Let's go. Well, if you listen to my if you listen to my uh, my sister, she said one day. I think you've made a pact with the devil, she said. <laughs> so I always felt it was the other way. I always felt that somehow when, the chips, when things were going bad, that how many games have we pulled them out of? Yeah, well. Arm shields. Melina did not get the, uh, was not voted the X. He said, uh, they're screwing me and he doesn't want to come out. It's just because I felt it was like too fa like too favoritism on the team, you know, and it shouldn't be that way. I thought it should be like the hardest workers and the most talent talented players should really get like should get the recommendations for college, and like I didn't feel like that was happening. He'll come in begging Demar, apologizing, and all that uh, garbage. Kids, it's like playing his history. What's the deal? You quit the team. Now you're hanging around the team? I don't understand it. I know. I never... You never what? I don't know. This and that. I don't know. 
Yesterday I just left, I just need time to think about it. Well, this is the third time you left the team. I mean, how many times do you quit a team before they, the organization says forget it? I don't know. It's not up to me. If you say, if you say I'm off the team, then I'm off the team. There's no point being here, but, but I'm saying if you off the team. I don't want this on camera here. For three years, me working my ass off. Then why did you leave? That's what I can't understand. Three years, you piss away. Because you didn't get an award? You listen carefully. You blew it. I'm not going to argue with you, because every time you come back, I get into a pissing contest. Now, I'm going to tell you, if you want to be back on the team, three things. I want you a sincere apology to the team, okay? Your ass better be out here tomorrow, okay? And you're going to sit the first day after the game. Now, if you can't handle those three things, you're done. You're done. I won't recommend you to a goddamn zoo. I want to take this time to apologize for being, like, an ass and selfish person, you know? I don't know why, like, like I felt like I had to do what I had to do, but it was obviously like the wrong decision, and uh, I hope you guys can find in your hearts to forgive me, you know, because uh, you guys are like my team, and. Um, I forgive you, Andrew. All right, let's get it. Good boy. Good boy. Our season doesn't mean shit. The past three years doesn't mean shit. We come down to this last game, and if we blow it, I mean. Everyone, you look back at your last three years and all you'll think about is this one game. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just sacrifice my body today. <laughs> it's, it's a cheap, cheap game, last game, man. Hershey, I'm pumped. Game plan early is not to give the Dustin the ball too much. I think we, uh, yeah, they're gonna be all pumped up to get him. So if we can surprise him with Canburn and then, you know, then start to pound him with the big boy. I feel like you hard. Fuck, he's huge. Wow. Rolls on the main event in Quad A, nationally ranked Central Bucks West, number three in the country against the number nine team in the country, the champion. At seven, there's one cocky guy. One cocky dude. Nobody looks down on us. All right, we'll respect them all the way till we kick their ass. Take it in. Go, Go baby! Special or unbalanced. Backside tackle. If he's in a beat guy, we'll trap the hell out of him. Okay. Now, few players have this opportunity in their lifetime. I told you before. We never play it up, but now we're on the threshold. And maybe I'll have to shake you a little bit to realize, look what you got in front of you. Look what you got in front of you. Three years would be unbelievable. 45 and 0 versus 44 and 1. That's the decision you got to make today. Come on, they're bigger, but I think they're soft. I think they're soft. You got to show them who lifts the weights. Everybody got to do a job, starting from the first play. All right, one, two, three. And the much anticipated quad A final is underway. Goes in motion, comes up on the left side, has the open set, pitches the day four. Looking at really one of the, I think, top ten players in the United States. Side ball is out. Ball is down. Who's got it? I think Gary Prep has got the first turnover of the night. And they it's so ready. Come here. Pashadi's hurt on the 22-yard line. Pashadi is hurt. Run, run, run.
This is a significant storyline in this game right here. Hey, you're going to show them you're not a one-man team. You understand that? You are not a one-man team. Right, the ball at the nine-yard line. This off the Carlson fumble. Coming with it, Cameron. Make that Blumgren for the touchdown. You know, the big man's gone. Then here's your chance to have an unbelievable victory. But we're a team. We're a team. You understand? Yeah, boys, let's do this shit. Let's go, baby. Like he's going over okay. I just Carlson back. Carlson looks into the end zone. Intercepted. Pinion and take it back for the touchdown. An wow. Incredible play. I don't believe what I just saw. Ed Hinkle took it away, and it's a touchdown. Keep your head up. Why didn't you knock it down? Why didn't you knock it down on fourth down? You never know, damn it. Get back in the damn game! Let's go! Get it back! Things are good now. Just that open offense like you're doing. We got open it up. We got a lot of weapons still. Make sure it comes up! Here we go! Throw it! Marcus Jr. won. Come on, one, three! He likes waggle. There are just those nights that you just don't push the right buttons. What did you get blood for that for? Shut up, damn it! Stop, stop, stop. There's nothing there. I'll tell you what, I feel Erie Prep gaining confidence as this game goes on. A whole nother fucking half, boy! A whole nother half! Keep your heads up! Can you take it the chat he's done? Yeah, he probably is, yeah. He's gonna try. Yeah, he, I think he just turned and sprained it. Where's Elsie? Drink up! Where's Elsie? Why would you line up in the backfield with two other backs? Don't you know have, any football? They told him they came in. They Get out! Stop making excuses! Alright, when's the last time I played deputation? There's only, you gotta have seven guys on the line. There were six guys on the line. All right. And somebody help him in there? Will you help the guy? Well then, stop making the penalties. Guys, let's fucking go. We got to pick the shit up. Guys, come on. Guys. Come on. But like in any panic game, if somebody gets a panic attack, you know, I, I think your mind can, can stop it. You get control and you just say, hey, I'm not going to let this happen. And, you know, it just will the situation to stop. Let's go. That's it, coach. It's my turn. I want to see your heads up. Why is anybody looking at the floor? Can't we win without Dustin? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Things mean more when you get it through adversity. Now, you are still the team that is pump weight forever. We better own the second half. You know they don't work like we work. All right, now, do you want it? Yeah! Do you want it? Yeah! Let's go. Let's go. This would have been a great victory if we could do it as it was, but now, with Dustin out, it would be more, more unbelievable if you do it. Third down. They need they need some help, I'm telling you. They need some help. Demon Sanders, big hole to the outside of the 10-5. Harry Preps on the lead. Touchdown. Woo! Let's go, guys. Man. Come back. Kicking into the teeth of the win. High snap. Shit. Look at that up, duck. Up, up, up. Oh, good. No good. It's short. Let's go, we're gonna get it back. 
All right, you're going to, going to give up or what? No, no, no. A lot of time, coach. A lot of time. What is, what is Junior like here? There you go again. They were lined up wrong again. How can they shift? Easter and now Cameron's hurt. And keep in mind, he's been suffering from shin splints. This will be DiGiacomo trying to get outside, I don't think so. And DiGiacomo reaching for his right leg as he's trying to get up. And you see now we got another guy hurt. Yo, what is Junior calling down? What is Junior liking up there? Flip the mat. Flip the mat, son. Flip the who? Mat. mat. There's nobody to flip to yet. All the running backs are dead. I'm not saying it's a joke, but see, this is for all the money. You've never played hurt before. I can't fucking walk on my can't walk jog on my fucking foot. I don't have any running backs. Bobby Ward, get up here! Someone's gotta step up with all the injuries that are hurting Central Bucks West. He doesn't know his plays and he tells you he knows his plays. He don't know your plays. Oh, now it's most of them. I don't get reps, so how am I supposed to Oh, now it's the, didn't I tell you in the beginning of the year some guys wouldn't get reps? But the guys that still can do that and play. Ward, you ready? Swing right, 57 quick pitch. Swing right, 57. Big hole, Bob Warden's first carry. Here's Warden, has been great in this fourth quarter. Bounces off, has the first down. The two-time defending state champs showing you why they are just an incredibly tough out. say, hey, lost the last game, I can't go out like this, you know, hey, that would be insane. Stop him right now! Stop him right now, this is it, no first downs! Get up. Now oh. the Central Bucks defense coming up. And to get your punt block ready. Punt block's off. Second block, Carlson back, throws, ball is pow, tipped oh, up into the air. Seven to go, and I'll tell you what, Ed Hinkle is going to make the most important punt of his life coming up here. For this is uh, really a moment of truth. Oh, that's They do they block. block it! It's blocked! It's touchdown! Incredible! It's a touchdown for Andrew Olsen! Unbelievable. Down, down, they're gonna kick, it's up, and it is gone! It's not over! It's not over! It's not over! Carlson back, Carlson long, gonna throw, it's out there, and it is tip, it's intercepted this time. It is caught by Kenyon, and he starts it back the other way, and he's got it all the way to the 44-yard line. The leader there is Carlson, he's got it, 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 he's got it,
the trifecta, the gold medal for the third consecutive year. Oh, oh, fucking unbelievable. That is the great thing. Oh, oh, the big guy. Oh, oh, oh. TV West, oh, West, 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 West. <laughs> Oh, I'm so proud of you. You're the greatest. It was so hard. That's a hell of a way to go out. That's a hell of a way to go out. I got a hundred bucks won. The bucks won. Yeah, that's the greatest victory ever. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. There was, there was some. There was some force other than what I understand involved in this game. Dustin, we never even get here without you, there, guy. All right. You were out there with us. All right. You all right? Let's keep going till they stop. Yes. <laughs> Killed. 